adjacency matrix for a graph and to draw the adjacency matrix it is very simple you simply draw the uh, a two uh, uh, a matrix or you can say two dimensional table and you write down all the vertices or nodes on the first row and in the first column and then you simply see which nodes are connected with each other with a line uh, one is not connected with one with a line so it is zero one is connected with two so whichever nodes are connected with a line we uh, write one for those nodes otherwise we write zero so one is connected with two write one connected with three yes write one not with four zero 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 and similarly now we see node two is connected with one three and four one three and four two is not connected with two with the line so it is zero sorry i write it here one one and all other cells contain zero so you are yourself very intelligent and you, and you can complete this table yourself as well and here is the solution for it uh, look so this way we can complete all the table this is the first line this one and the second line this one and the remaining matrix can be completed by you you are very competent i know uh, this was a uh, adjacency matrix for a simple undirected graph and now we write the adjacency matrix for a weighted and directed graph the directed graph has arrows it means we can move from one to the node two but not the other way around we cannot move from two towards one and in addition to that at this we also have a weight you can call it the distance and so for this adjacency matrix we will write the distance between two nodes like the distance from 1 towards 2 is 25 right here 25 1 to 2 and distance between 1 and 1 is 0 and distance between 1 and 3 is infinite because we do not have any direct path from 1 to 3 so here we write infinity that is this symbol and similarly the distance between one and all other nodes is infinity sorry okay uh, and now we fill up the next row the distance between 2 and 1 is infinity because we do not have any direct path from 1 towards from 2 towards 1 so right here, here infinity and here it is 0 the distance between 2 and 2 is 0 2 and 3 is yes there is a direct line and its weight is 10 our distance is 10 and 2 and 4 yes there is a direct line and its distance is 14 but 2 and 5 no direct line infinity infinity and infinity and like all i already said you are yourself very intelligent and you and you can complete this whole table and here is a solution for this table uh, i completed first line and second line and the rest is your homework so it is that was uh, adjacency matrix very simple and stay tuned for the uh, topic of adjacency list thank you